Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. We're going to do a little drive with me. I want to do this video because it's been like a month and some change that we haven't really spoken and I just really want to fill you guys in on like where I've been and what I'm doing because um, school's over and there's just many little things that I'm gonna start doing so um, <clears throat> I just want to fill you guys in on like what's been going on. My ears look weird to me. Um, first things first, if you guys are new here, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. <sighs> so basically, the last time we saw each other, I think I got like my Mexican residency and that was that. Um, and then, so fast forward, school already finished. Um, I finished my second to last semester and I'm really just like ready for this career that I have going on right now with school to be over with. It's just very demanding um, with a baby and then classes and then professors and it's just like bro like I'm just like over it already like yeah. So, um, and then I got into it. I had to like really, this semester, this last semester was like one that I really had to be like asking a lot of professors for like favors on this. I, like I told you guys last time, I missed two midterms. The professor was so kind to open them up again for me. Then I was late for registration. I had to meet with my academic advisor. And then I had to like hound down one of the professors to let me get into a class that I needed because it was already full. And so you guys can just imagine like, oh my God, what I was going through. But luckily everything turned out pretty well. The professors and the faculty at Texas Tech are just amazing. They, they helped me so much. So that is done. That's it with school next semester. I'm taking four more classes. Um, I've got two classes in one day so one three hour class and then the other one's like an hour and a half so on Mondays is gonna be like my busiest day and that's as far as it goes for like my school wise um, other than that uh, right now I'm taking Romina to some stimulant class she's been doing that every Saturday and oh my god we love taking her to those classes and it's not so much like to stimulate her and to make her like do her other things it's just more so to get her to do what she has to do you know so I'm just excited about that and hold on because there's like a cop like right here like watching me and I, I'm, uh, I don't even got my license but um but yeah so it's like more so to to just like get her stimulated on the things that she has to do and yeah i mean that's it i mean she's just going to be there with like little kids her age and like as soon as we take her in there like she just loves it i'm sorry i kind of like lost my train of thought because like i really don't want to get pulled over here in mexico but um no he he really drove up um and he was on a motorcycle guys so anyways yeah so as far as it goes to um into like Romina's situation I'm taking her to a stimulation class and um, they teach her like how to crawl and how to walk and you know they're teaching them to like learn um, directions and things like that so like I said it's more so for her to get like that stimulate that stimulation and um, that like seeing other babies and hearing other babies and I, you see all these other parents there and it's like she just loves it she loves it and so we take her there every saturday um and she enjoys it so much and that's like what we have going on for romina and then as far as like this season i cut my hair i didn't record that um 
it was just like something that I said, you know what, I'm done with because I do feel that like with my postpartum, I already lost, I would shed hair before I got pregnant. And then I got pregnant and then I did not share, shed one hair. Like I never shed any hair when I was pregnant. And then after I had the baby, my hair was falling out like crazy. And it's like, I don't have bald spots or anything. And I don't know if it's just like the regular hair foliage that I have, or is it still postpartum? Like I'm already gonna be 10 months postpartum. Like what's going on? So um, I went and I chopped off my hair. My hair is like right here right now and it just feels amazing. Like it's not heavy on me no more. My hair is still falling out, but I mean like they're little hairs. So um, they're not like the super long hairs no more that were like so annoying. There was like a house. I look like a cat. Like there's house, there's hair all over the house. Um, but what else? What else? Um, but yeah, so we are here in Christmas. Like. December we already did our family photos we already built our gingerbread houses we decorated the house I mean this Christmas like the last few years I really wasn't like too much in the spirit of like decorating and doing all of that and I really wasn't into it this year either but I said it's my first year with my baby and I don't want to be a sourpuss so I decorated I mean with everything going on like school and just like not having enough time I was able to do it I decorated and um we already took our family pictures. We already did the gingerbread houses. I already got our PJs for Christmas day, the matching family PJs. Yes, we're doing that. And um, that's about it. I still haven't made tamales this December. I need to make tamales. I already have the meat and everything that I need to. I just didn't bring it out um, because it has to thaw out. And then I have to, um, and then I have to put it in the crock pot for six hours. So I just feel like I'm not going to have time to do it today. But um, yeah, that's like where we're at. And now fast forward to right now. This is my second week going to the gym. And I am feeling pretty good. I wake up every day at 9 in the morning and I'm at the gym by like 10.30. Um, me and John have like worked out our arrangements on like how it's gonna be, like how he's gonna take care of the baby because like during the week he has to work. So I go in the morning because John's really not like an early person. So I take the morning shift and I go to the gym. And then when I get back like at noon, noon or so, it's my shift with the baby. So um, yeah, I am going three days a week to the gym and I feel pretty good. Like I already see changes in my body, like my self-esteem, like it, it's, it's like a whole mental thing guys. And um, I'm not even going, you know, to be like the healthiest person. Like I'm just like going for, you know, basically the therapeutic aspects of bodybuilding. <sighs> but yeah and another thing that like i i don't know like i'm not really gonna tell you like what it is but since i stopped going to school like i'm on my break right now and i've had like a lot of time to like think i have like thought that i'm gonna put a business i'm gonna put a business here in mexico it's kind of like a hobby slash like if i can like make it you know into a living i can and like that's the idea like to start making money off of it and so it's just gonna be like a small little business it's like a five thousand dollar startup business and um, i'm pretty excited for it i'm not gonna tell you guys what it is yet because there's a lot of people that watch my videos people who like me people who don't like me and um you know i just I don't want to say, oh, I'm going to do this and then have people praying for my downfall. Like, um, I just, I don't, no matter how happy you are or how, you know, you're not in drama. There's always people that, you know, wish bad upon you. So I don't want to share like what it is. Um, hopefully in the end of January, early February, you guys will be hearing about it because obviously I'm going to be like telling you guys about my journey and how it goes for me. But yeah, I said, you know what? I'm going to open a business. 
um, who knows how it's gonna go starting a business having a toddler um, going to school full-time I don't know but that's just how life has been lately with just like the going and going and going and going so um, yeah that is basically like my little update with you guys and I wanted to do an update because I'm going to start vlogging again. I'm not going to make no promises because I feel like this is such a toxic relationship that we have. Like I tell you, I'm going to come back and then I don't. And then I come back like three months later and it's just like a whole like little fiasco with us. So yeah, that is my little update for you guys. Um, if you guys enjoyed these little like drive with me's, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button and don't forget to leave me some comments.